What's up? Space Monkey here and welcome back to another Call of Duty weapons video and today we're on Call of Duty World War 2 and we're going to talk about an assault rifle called the Automaton. Now I'm not sure if I actually said the name right um, but here's another one that I have difficulty saying the correct way and it's the only variant I have of this weapon. That's why I haven't put a video out of this weapon yet. Uh, because usually I like to have two variants at least to show off uh, for gameplay. Uh, but all in all, um, I've decided to go ahead and make one anyway. And this weapon is actually a really good weapon. It's uh, a uh, three or four shot kill range. Um, but it really, honestly, uh, who keeps up with how many bullets you really put into an enemy? You're just all about really just trying to take them down. Now, if you want to be technical, then you, you can keep up with the uh, stats and everything else. That's pretty much what that goes in the category. Um, but this video and all other videos I make about these weapons is just to uh, show off the uh, bloodthirsties uh, with that weapon and talk about how difficult or challenging it is to get with that weapon. Now, right here in this clip, um, I decided to go and play free for all, and uh, it put me at almost the very end of this game. Uh, we had like uh, three minutes left in the game, and uh, that's actually a long enough time to, uh, you know, try to get me a nice little bloodthirsty. Uh, I was just deciding to uh, check out that new little camo. I got that blue camo um, out of a uh, box. I thought it looked cool. So I decided to slap it on there. Um, this is definitely a weapon that uh, pretty much it's an assault rifle. It's got a different feel to it. Um, the uh, fire rate is kind of moderately slow, uh, but it's actually a very deadly assault rifle. I mean, it takes down... Uh, the people that are, uh, you're playing against um, in like no time at all. Uh, so where that uh, three bullet to kill range, three to four bullet kill range goes on there, um, I really didn't honestly keep up with how many times it took to shoot the uh, bad guys. I just concentrated on getting that five piece. And pretty much, you know, you go on shipment with this weapon, uh, you're going to do great. Uh, this is another weapon out there uh, that is actually uh, really well. It did really good. Um, you know, the recoil, everything about this weapon is something that you find yourself um, adapting to very quickly. Uh, it's a very easy weapon to play with. And it's fun. Um, you know, uh, I always have a lot of fun playing on uh, all these Call of Duty games anyway, but. You know, going through each weapon and experience and, you know, what it takes to play with that weapon is also fun, too. And, uh, I had a lot of fun playing with this weapon. So, I hope you guys have it already or have more variants than I do of it. I mean, I only have one, so you should have more than I do already by now. Uh, this is definitely a fun gun to play with. Uh, you, without the red dot sight, with the red dot sight. Uh, I even slapped on the uh, ACOG site and decided to play with that on shipment also, um, but this is definitely a fun weapon to play with. Uh, so once again, today's weapon is the Automaton on Call of Duty World War II. Uh, it is a DLC weapon. Um, you have to get lucky and get it in a box, get a variant of it in the box, or if you've uh, bought it in a collection that was uh, open a while back, then have the same variant that I do um, but once again hope you guys enjoyed today's gameplay today's video don't forget to smash that like button on the way out your support is definitely needed and appreciated don't forget to subscribe be part of the monkey squad keep up with all the content that I put out I cover all Call of Duties on the PS4 as of right now it's another bloodthirsty video uh, going on the countdown. So once again, thanks for watching. This is Space Monkey. Until next time, peace. Dropping Azon bomb. Baker is ours.